here is free spoke app uh, let's explore what that is um, basically this is an alternative search engine to google uh, and bing and yahoo a lot of them okay it may sound ambitious but yeah, this is just like one of those apps, which is a bit on the right side, on the right wing, a conservative side in the United States. And it's founded by former Republican National Committee Finance Chair Todd Ricketts. Uh, he launched a, a free spoken alternative to Google uh, earlier this year, like in 2022. I think the mobile app was launched around May 2022. He believes Americans have a duty to protect free speech. When free speech is under attack, our whole society is under attack. Rick has told Fox News Digital. A few years ago, as I was looking for things on searching on the internet, I felt like I just wasn't getting the result that I expected. Uh, so yeah, that's basically the whole idea of the app. And there are more and more apps in this category recently, like Parler, which is like similar to Twitter. By, but more on the right side there is rumble uh, like uh, yeah there are a bunch of other websites and uh, apps because people are not like really trusting uh, twitter or facebook instagram mainstream social media they think there can be some algorithm censorship or something around it therefore there is a huge niche for this a bit more conservative apps which claim to to have more neutral approach either to social media or to search engines and all of that so yeah in this video let's just go through the free spoke app explore how it works uh, can it be helpful for you or it, is it really different because recently it starts to spike in the in the top search results and top app results in the us app store uh, this app believes that the first amendment is not negotiable uh, uh, it's time to declare information independence on the internet search reimagined be free free spoke is an independent search engine that lets you search for anything our display helps you compare viewpoints to find the truth faster without being tracked use free spoke as your search engine when you are looking to quickly understand the full story or scroll through the top 40 trending news stories below the search bar to get a feel for what's going on across the nation and the world uh, you can click on the story headlines to get a quick summary and also see related stories. So there is search, there is news search, there are trending news stories and they claim to show censored articles which are not shown on other search engines or other social media apps. Articles tagged as standard highlight information of viewpoints suppressed by mainstream media and include the latest victims of cancel culture and then there are best of web articles. So this is just their description. Let's go through the app. So here you can see how the app looks like. Uh, you don't need to create an account at this point. I think the account creation feature is coming later in the development process. So it's, it's not there yet. So for example, if we just search here, uh, so also you, you instantly get popular searches i don't know how these searches are curated and like what influences them but it's also important uh, so here you can see some uh, results so if i just send search for send you can see some recommendations uh, from near places you can see uh, some twitter accounts uh, you can see some Wikipedia links. Okay, some definitions. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay, let's search something neutral. Uh, so again, you just see Wikipedia. Uh, and then you see a lot of results. And it looks like Google, actually. Yeah, so then you can see some news. Then you can see some images. Uh, image search was recently released here. Of course, it sounds like, uh, wait, is it like 2002 or something that there is like image search? And, but this is like a new search engine and they are just trying out all these features. Then there is find new section uh, uh, where uh, you have all the recent news. You can see what's hot 
and here they claim this news to be completely neutral and to include some results which might be censored, for example, on Yahoo or Bing or Google. Then you have breaking news, still they are linking to Twitter. Then you have section which is called censored. So that's kind of interesting section. You can read here. Uh, so that's basically, you can see that. Uh, then you have trending. You, then you see best of web, trending, trending. That's, uh, I don't know what's the algorithm here, how they select trending posts or what's being included here. Maybe in the future, it would be nice just to disclose completely this algorithm and make it open source and just so that users can clearly see what's what's going into the trending section and what's not so that i think it's the future like decentralized web web3 maybe not but of course then uh, since seems uh, it's like a bit right-wing app you have a lot of links from like uh, conservative news outlets like Fox News, but also have like CNN and okay. Uh, so there is some kind of balance here. Yeah, and then you can just browse through it. Actually, a lot of people just using this app just for consuming news. So that can be important section. Then you see free, uh, like free spoke home base. Uh, you can select how to use FreeSpoke. It's an independent search engine that lets you search for anything. Our display helps you compare viewpoints to find the truth faster than being tracked. Use FreeSpoke as a search engine when you're looking to quickly understand the full story or scroll through the top 40 trending news stories uh, below the search bar to get a feel for what's going on across the nation and the world. So again, the research, new search, trending news stories, standard and best of the web. That's what I've just shown you. Uh, then uh, you can see free spoke. And then you can just read read this. Uh, so yeah, that's the idea. Um, then if you want, you can just reach out and get in touch uh, reach out to our support team. Is free spoke app on on Android Google Play Store? Yes, it is. It's in Google Play Store, uh, so you can uh, see that. And yeah, overall design looks very minimalistic, very efficient. It doesn't feel like you really need to explain a lot of things and all of that. So that's basically just how it works. Uh, yeah, so that's uh, what's going on here. You can see some interesting guides. Uh, I think the team is working hard to uh, get new features within this app. You'll soon be able to discover American made and local brands when you use our search to shop for products. Mm. Instead of seeing big box stores like Amazon or Walmart, first we'll highlight products from American and local mark makers. And then soon they will release profiles. Uh, you'll be able to create your own profile to become a true long lasting free folker. You'll be able to save content and customize the search experience. So that's that. Uh, that's an overview. Uh, hope it was helpful.